Hello, Stimpy back again, and today I'm going to do a vlog. And sort of a uh, update on a previous vlog. If you click down below, there'll be a link to my previous vlog on the Power Rangers Mighty Morphin Power Rangers reboot. Now there's been no news brought out about this film, and I've already mentioned what I thought about the make of this film being rebooted in my previous vlog, so I'm not going to that. That was for, that was a previous day. But we have the new writers. The writers have been announced as Ashley Miller and Zach Starks. Now these two have worked on a couple of films that I quite like. Actually, well, they were good films. There was Thor and X-Men First Class, plus a list of other films. But yeah, these are good films. These were, well, Thor was actually well written even though I didn't like Thor. So that's given a little more hope on this film. Also, they've been given it as the producer who has all this as Roberto Orico. And this person he's what he's produced and wrote a couple of big films as well as Transformers, The Amazing Spider Man Two and the new re, the new Star Trek reboots. Now I've not watched the Star Trek reboots but People that have, and people who I'm not a Star Trek fan, I've never have been, so I never really fancied the film. People who have seen them have told me they're fantastic, and I've actually heard a few times saying they're a really, really good reboot. So, with this saw in, and sort of, yeah, so because technically X Men First Class is almost a reboot of a rebootish start of. Reboot for the X Men trilogy since the well, X Men, the third one, and Origins Rick Transformer, uh, Rick the X Men. So, yeah, who knows? It could be good. They haven't announced anything else, they haven't announced the they haven't announced any actors in it yet. I did read on Facebook, somebody posted a link a couple of days ago on Facebook about David Jason Frank, Jason David Frank coming back as Tommy for the film that's not been confirmed. I follow him on Facebook and there's not been any mention of this film on his Facebook at all. So yeah I think that's just the rumour we're working up and maybe it's just people like me who would love to see this happening who started this rumour up because yeah I would love to see this happening. So yeah I thought I'd update you on this idea since I have done a video, a film, a video on this and this news has been revealed so I thought I'd tell you a little bit about it. Also there's been new news out as well. There's a couple of things out happened recently. There's also the there's a few thing happening right now in comic books in the sort of comic book realms and now in the Marvel comic book realms there's big things happening. They are killing off Wolverine which is a bit of old news people have known this that's a bit old news now, and that could be quite good. That could also be Marvel's way, Marvel Studios and Disney's way of getting the copyright back for Wolverine and bring back to life for a film in, a wolf in their own studios way. They've also turned, they've turned Thor into a woman. This is happening, this is coming up in recent uh, comic books coming up soon today. So yeah, that could be good. And other big news is I've reviewed I, I, uh, Captain America Winter Soldier when it first came out. I reviewed it when I went and seen it. And there's been new news for that linking sort of to the film universe that people would know from seeing Captain America the Winter Soldier. In the comic book realm right now and coming out in autumn or fall depending where you stay. Captain America has to, Steve Rogers anyway, has lost his superpowers, his super soldiers serums ran out sort of thing. I don't know how they're gonna do this. But if Lee's lost his strength and so he has to put his shield down and replace it for a walking stick. And the Falcon is going to come in and take over his role. They'll get that so right that you think, okay, so what he's just gonna take his his wings off and jump in the suit. No no. It's gonna run about in the suit and have wings. I think this comic book might be really good. I'm going to give them a read. I'm going to certainly pre-order them all. 
because I would love to see how that storyline will turn out because that could be a really, really interesting storyline and that's out October time, that'll be out uh, autumn time, or fall time as I said, so yeah. That's my sort of, I thought I'd give you a bit of geek news. That title name, just come up with a title name right there, that's what I'm going to call this this video, my geek view, news vlog. So yeah, that was me just a fact update, you know, the things I'd heard recently, the these things I've just came to light in the last day or two, and that's me just kind of managed to give you a little vlog update on them. So yeah, thanks for tuning in, remember, hit the like button, tell me what your thoughts on both these topics are, tell me what your thoughts on are on the Power Rangers reboot, tell me what you think of the new writers, and it's like for just enjoying this role, because they're here, they have done good films. Also, tell me a little about what you think of Thor becoming a woman, Marvel killing off Wolverine, and the Falcon stepping in as Steve Rogers as Captain America. Go check out if you can. I can't really get a photo of it. I don't, I don't have good enough software to show the photo, but go check up the photo online of what, it, what it's going to look like. It looks amazing. And then tell me what you think. So yeah, just tuning in. And, alright, press the red button down below to subscribe, and I'll see you later. Cheers. <laughs>